Yo, what's up everybody on YouTube? It's the one other kid, Cardiac, back with another review on a dope shoe that came out last weekend. It's taking me a little time to, you know, open a box. I've had a lot of packages this past week. Just haven't had time to really go through them, but I got a good one for you guys. I got a real good one. But yeah, this is the review and unboxing of the Jordan 12 Chinese New Year. Now this is the, the one that had in the GS size. You guys know I got a little feet, you know. I can get some great shoes, sometimes a great school size, as you know. The quality is a little bit diminished. So you have to kind of be careful with what you got, you know, what you, what you want to invest in because you're not going to get the same quality as some of the adult sizes. But, you know, this particular shoe that I picked up, I think I think I, I think I did all right. I think I did all right. So without further ado, roll that footage. <laughs> So yeah guys, here it is. The Jordan 12 Chinese New Year's. Now in the box, it says light or wood brown and varsity red. I'm not sure what that means. If you guys want a closer look at it. Bam. Yeah, um, first look at these shoes, they're actually the quality is not bad at all. It's a it's a leather. Not 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 the best leather I've seen, but it's more of like a plush leather, which makes it pretty cool. Pretty cool indeed. Um I think the colorway on these shoes is dope. I believe my light is actually letting it shine a little bit more. But this is more like a beige or an off-white. Yeah, you guys can see it. It's more of a beige or off-white shoe. It's actually pretty nice. Nice varsity red. The Chinese symbols on the tongue of the shoe. Nice little gold hints on the eyelets. And it did some gold hints on the side, right above the, the midsole of the shoe. Nice little leather that comes in, got a nice design. Kind of reminds me of like a stitching, maybe like a wood stitching. Give you guys a closer look so you can see. Nice white bottom, you know. Of course, the gray school size has had a fake carbon fiber. And it looks like it has a kind of a gold pattern under the plastic of the shoe, which is kind of cool. Nice little added touch to it. The red, it really makes it pop out. On the inside of the shoe, we also have some um, Chinese characters as well. The same that are on the tongue, they're just on the inside of the shoe. Overall, I think it was a nice pickup, you guys. I think. A lot of people wish that these actually came in adult sizes, mainly because they think that the other shoes that came out look more like the taxis, just with this added design on it. And they wish they could have got an opportunity to cop these as well. So, kind of a toss up, you know, but honestly, I think these are really nice shoes. First time I saw it, of the two, I felt like, you know, this was a shoe that I wanted to cop of the two. I could have copped the taxis or the Chinese New Year, black and white Chinese New Year, but I just, you know, I got a lot of black and white shoes, so that would just be sitting on my shelf for sure. But I think we'll get these a rock. I might wear them more when we get close to the springtime. It does look like it'll hold up in weather. So if it rains, this will actually be a great shoe to wear. Um, so yeah, I, I definitely like this colorway. Definitely think it's a hot shoe. I think uh, somebody said it's supposed to have like a 3M to it, but I'm not seeing it yet. And maybe it doesn't. Maybe it was just a tax there, or the black and white colorway they have it. So I'm gonna have to shine this on the light and let you guys know, but I think it's a dope shoe. So let me know if you guys cop the shoe. If you think it's cops cop, to drop. Or if you wish that it came in adult sizes, so you could have copped it. And I think they ran it up to a nine and a half grade school sizes, which is a regular nine and a half in men's. But you know, people with big feet, you just, you shit out of luck. So anyway, I think, you know, me personally, it's probably gonna end up being on my top list of shoes that I picked up this year for 2017, for sure. Especially when I get enough, you know, a little wear and tear in and see how it holds up. I definitely have a better, better understanding or a better, I'll have a better feel to the shoe and you know, give you guys a, 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 a nice on feet. I think uh, personally, I probably won't, will wait until the springtime to wear this shoe, mainly because weather's kind of crappy right now. And plus, you know, this shoe is a light color shoe, you know. Sometimes you can rock white in the winter and it comes out okay. This personally, I think it's a better spring and summer shoe, so that's just, that's just my opinion. Um, but yeah, guys, let me know in the comments below if you managed to cop these shoes or if you copped them for your kids or if you copped them for your girl. Let me know, man. Let me know in the comments. So, yeah, so make sure you subscribe and hit that like button below as always. Thank you guys for coming in. It's really been a pleasure. And I'm looking forward to more things we do. As always, you can follow me on SoundCloud, Snapchat, Tumblr, Twitter, Instagram. Everything is what? Kid Cardiac. And I'm out as always.